Today in Minecraft, I prank my friend Melon by using magic touch and making everything turn invisible. Sonny, have you seen my switch? I can't find it anywhere. Uh, no, I definitely did not. Did you check outside yet? Why would it be outside? Goats, watch this. It's not outside, Sonny. Wait, where did the house go? Tell me how I should prank Melon next in the comment section below. <sighs> Another day in Minecraft. But Melon, I've been having so much trouble lately with my cell phone. It's not been working. The signal's been trash. I can't even call my mom on it. Man, that sucks for you. Check this this out, Sonny. I've made the world's biggest ball of snot. Ew! Get that away from me! You're disgusting! Come here, Sonny. Come over here. Don't touch me with that thing! Ah! Yeah! Gross! I'm covered in melon snot. Ugh. Okay, I'm sorry about that, Sonny. I, I heard Quandale's in the business of fixing phones now. You think you can make it up to me? You just covered me in snot! Listen, listen, Sonny. Quandale will make it up to you. Not me. Uh, whatever, bro. Let me go find him. Quandale, where's your shop, bro? And I can't wait to show him this snot. Bro, nobody wants to see the world's biggest ball of snot. Dude, that is disgusting. Go clean your nose out. I bet you Quandale would want to. Taking a vacation? Sorry. See you in a month. Wait, what? Quandale never takes vacations. In a whole month? This is so unlike Quandale. What's going on? Bro, this is an emergency. We've got to find Quandale. Yeah. Yeah, he needs to see my snot. Oh, Melon, no, he really doesn't. No, no, he definitely does, Sonny. Oh, beautiful. I have diamond armor. Uh, Sonny, that's my armor. Wait, what? No, that's my di- Melon! No, this is my armor, Sonny. This is my stand. This is yours. I, uh, <laughs> kind of sold all your armor so I could contribute to this ball of snot. Are you kidding me? You took my diamond armor and sold it to villagers so that they could just blow their nose onto your green, disgusting block? Yeah, pretty much. Ugh. Oh, don't worry, Quandale. I'll find you. And so will I. And then I'll rub my snot all over you. Wait, Sonny, I found one of Quandale's associates. Hey, do you have any idea where Quandale went? Yeah, he headed east last time I saw him. Thanks so much. Also, check out the snot. No, 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 Melon, he doesn't want to see that. Uh, do you think maybe, mister, you could fix my phone? Dang it, Melon, now he doesn't want to talk to us. <laughs> Sonny, it was worth it. Much, much, much later. Bro, we've been traveling east forever. Wait, Sonny, I think I see something. What are these beacons? I have no idea. But this doesn't look like Quandale's vacation spot. This looks like a laboratory. What the heck is this place? But Quandale is into this kind of stuff, so he could be here. Yeah, maybe he's at a science conference. Anyway, Sonny, let's check it out. Yo, this thing is awesome. Dude, this must be one of those fancy conventions where they show off the latest tech and gadgets. This place looks cool. Wait, Sonny, why is everything empty? No one's even here. Yeah, you're right. This does feel a little bit ominous. What is this place? And Sonny, this purple block in the middle. I can't even get to it. It's like there's a force field in the way. Wait, you're right. There's barriers. What the heck? Wait, Melon, look out. Who the heck is this guy? I have no idea. Kill him, Buzz135. He's attacking me. Melon, you took the diamond armor, but you didn't bring a sword? No, but I have my snot. Die! Yes. I just snotted all over him. Bro, that's gross. You actually killed him with a giant booger. Anyways, Sonny, what do you think's up with this place? I don't know, Melon, but we've got to find our way into this purple area. It's got to be something important. Yeah. Sonny, using my detective skills, if we look, it looks like each of these houses is their own unique generator. Wait, except for this one. This one's got nothing. Yeah, don't worry about it. That's the exception. Uh, Melon, this one seems pretty cool. What is this? I I don't know. But check this out, Sonny. Look, diamond, light, iron, light, gold. These are all the different generators. Check it out. They correspond to each house. You're right, bro. Each of these beacon lights matches this. This is the gold one. This is the emerald, Jenny. This is the iron and the diamond. Oh, and there's even a netherite generator right here. I think these are power generators, Sonny. Maybe if we deactivate them, the force field will drop. Dude, you're actually a genius. Did you activate your fifth melon seed? I did, Sonny. Now, please tell me you brought the pickaxe. Uh...
Yeah. I think I forgot the pickaxe. Please tell me it's in my backpack. Oh, it actually is. Uh, Melon, we're good. I got the pickaxe. Sonny, let's deactivate these generators, starting with the weakest one. No, 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 not that one, Sonny. Not that one. Iron. Oh, sorry, sorry. Iron. Okay, let me give it a try. I'm gonna check the control room. I want to see if it works. Okay. I depowered it. It shut down when I broke one of the blocks. Yo, it worked, Sonny. The lamps below the iron generator are turned off. Nice. I wonder if that'll work for each of these. I'm gonna break the gold generator next. How does it look in the control room? Yo, Sonny, the gold is deactivated. That's perfect. I'm off to the diamond generator. And don't mind if I do take all of these blocks, guys. I'll be able to craft myself full diamond armor now. Just gotta turn these back into regular diamonds and find myself a tree. Sonny, the diamond one's deactivated. Uh, Sonny? Sonny? Yeah, what's up? I just deactivated the netherite generator. Yeah, it's deactivated. What took you so long on the diamond one? Uh, nothing. Anyways, I just turned off the emerald generator. It worked, Sonny. They're all deactivated. Yo, I hope the barriers are down. Uh, Sonny, where are you, bro? Uh, <laughs> nowhere. Just had a little business to attend to. Uh, all right. Almost done. One of these, one of those. A little bit of this little bit of that. <sighs> Melon, would you prefer an axe or a sword? Uh, both. Well, good thing I'm rich now. Perfect, guys. I got all the gear I need. Ugh, get that out of my inventory. So, Melon, what was that about the barrier? Whoa, Sonny, you have full diamond? Yeah, and I even got these for you. How the heck did you do that? I stole all the diamond blocks from the diamond generator. Oh, that's actually really smart. And Sonny, check this out. No more barrier. This is awesome. But what does this thing do? I have no idea, Sonny. Whoa! Where am I? Where did you go? Look down! I got teleported underground somehow. How? Melon, I have no clue, but this place is creepy! I want to get out of here! Let me out! Let me out! Whoa! How did I get out of there? I have no idea how you're doing that, Sonny. One second I was here, the next I was beneath it, then I was just trying to jump out of there, and suddenly I was up here again. I don't get it. Uh, I don't really get it, Sonny. I'm clicking buttons. I'm- Whoa! What the heck? Melon, how did you do that? I think when you crouch on the block, Sonny, you get teleported. Hold on, let me try this. Crouch. Whoa, you're right. Crouch. Whoa, where am I? That is so weird. And if you jump, you go up. Okay, Melon, let's investigate this first floor. Whoa, what the heck is this place? Uh, this looks really evil, dude. Do you see that? What are all those Wither Skull King things? I don't know, but they look pretty evil, Melon. And they're behind a locked door door. Maybe 6969. Dang it. No, Melon, I know the passcode. Zero, one, two, three, enter. Dang it. I'm out of ideas. We should look for clues in order to get into this room, Sonny. Whoa. What is this place? Oh, this is... <gasps> Yo, Dr. Logbottoms is right there, Sonny. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out of there. Oh, I think he might have seen me. I don't think he saw you, because if he did, he'd probably be yelling at us like always. You're right, Sonny. We gotta investigate everything. This could be one of his nefarious plans. Maybe he even kidnapped Quandale. Dude, that actually makes sense. He probably has Quandale working on experiments for him because he knows Quandale's got the biggest brain. Sonny, there might be a floor below. Hold on. Whoa! Yeah, Melon, I was already down here earlier. What is this place? I don't know. I just saw a lot of books, so I left because it was hurting my head. But maybe the books have something to do with the code. 1712? Whoa. 6969. I already tried 6969. It didn't work. 0506 and 2510. Wait, Wait, Melon, I'll go up and you read me the codes. Okay, I got you. Sonny, the first code is 2510. I'm trying it. Bro, that's wrong. I already tried 6969. Try 0506. Hey. Dude, that didn't work either. Incorrect code. One more attempt left before self-destruct. Bro, what the heck? If we don't get it right next, we're gonna explode. It has to be this one, Sonny. 1712. 1712. That worked. I'm in. Let's go. No. Melon, there's another barrier protecting this place. I can't access it, but I can open this really creepy chest. Whoa, potion of invisibility. That must be how we get around the barrier, Sonny. Uh, how would invisibility help you pass a barrier? Uh, 
I don't know, man. It probably would. Bro, I think you used up all your brain power. Obviously, this potion will be used so that I can sneak around Dr. Longbottom's lab and find a way to disable the barriers. Oh, you're right. Also, Sonny, take my snot and snot up Dr. Longbottom's. Oh, you're so gross. Why don't you do it? <laughs> Fine, Sonny. I'm going invisible. Uh, Melon, you gotta take your armor off. Yes, I know, Shani. I know everything. Dude, you're so sneaky right now. He'll have no clue. Dr. Longbottom, just gonna leave this snot right there for you. You're welcome. And now, Sonny, whoa, there's some valves here. Maybe I could rotate these to get rid of the barriers. Okay, Melon, give it a try. See what happens. I'm rotating them, Sonny. Whoa, Melon, that worked. But there's still another security layer. There's some laser beams here blocking me from this chest. Maybe this one deactivates the laser beams. Please work. Whoa, it worked. You disabled the laser beam security system. And now I can open the chest. Whoa. The magic touch key. Give me that. And uh, Melon, I think you should re-enable his security. So it looks like we were never even here. You're right. Let me spin it the other way. And it's been re-abled. Nice, that worked. And Melon, crank the other one to do the barrier blocks. Yep, Sonny, I got you. It worked. Nice job, Melon. Let's get out of here quick. Yeah, Sonny, I'm dipping. And jump. Yo, Sonny, what did you get from that chest? Let me show you, bro. You're not gonna believe it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I got a crafting table. Bro, what? Maybe this is some kind of super secret crafting table. Sonny, I'm gonna try to crack the secret behind this. Yeah, it's got special properties to it. It's a magical crafting table. Anyways, I'm gonna head home. I'm kind of hungry. I could use a bite to eat. <laughs> yeah, same. And I need to be in my workstation to examine this crafting table. Guys, he is so dumb. Melon's actually convinced that's a magic crafting table. Oh, I'm so hungry. It's a good thing I have leftovers in the fridge. I have this beautiful slice of cake. I think I even have shrimp pasta. Mmm, yum, 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 yum. Let's see, leftover shrimp. Uh, nope, that's not good. Maybe my cake. Dang it, the freezer's empty. Maybe I left it in the drawers. How about my cookies? Bro, there's nothing left here but a bucket of water. Uh, Melon, what did you do with all of our food? Sonny, I've been working on this crafting table, bro. And I got really hungry and then I ate everything. Dude, even my shrimp pasta. Yeah, dude, it was pretty good. Anyways, back off, bro. I'm figuring out this crafting table. This way, once I get to the bottom of this, we could craft any food, any items, and be the richest people in Minecraft. Yeah, good luck with that, Melon. Okay, guys, let me try this magic touch key out. Melon's talking about getting rich. How about I become the richest player in Minecraft? Yeah. So what if our house was made of diamonds? Whoa, it actually worked. All the cobblestone got switched to diamonds diamond blocks. This is amazing. We're gonna be so rich. I mean, I'm gonna be so rich and Melon will be a peasant forever. That's what he gets for eating my shrimp pasta. Guys, I have a genius plan. I'm gonna turn that crafting table that Melon thinks is magical into a cake. Wait, what happened to the crafting table? Why is it a cake? <laughs> Maybe this crafting table can become anything I want. Oh, Melon, this cake looks delicious. Thanks. What is wrong with you? You ate the crafting table. That could have been anything. Thing. Yeah, but it was a delicious cake that's now in my tummy. Sonny, you've ruined everything. You're a dead man. Die. Hey, Melon, relax, bro. Don't you see the house? It's covered in diamonds. Wait, what the heck? This is beautiful. Sonny, do you have a pick? I don't have a pick to mine this. Hold on, hold on. Here's a pickaxe. Enjoy. Oh, yes. We're gonna be rich. I mean, I'm gonna be rich. Yes. Give me all the diamonds. That's it, guys. Melon thinks he could just collect all the diamonds and become the richest player in Minecraft. But little does he know, I possess the magic touch. And I'm gonna cover our entire house in barriers! It worked! <laughs> it's covered in barriers! Oh, this is perfect. Guys, I'm so rich. I'm just gonna sell this all, and then I'll move out! Yes, all I've gotta do is find a vendor. Woo! <sighs> Beautiful. Wait, what the heck? Why can't I get out? Wait, why is our house surrounded by barrier blocks? Sorry, Melon, I can't hear you. What's that? No, oh, Sonny, Sonny, you gotta do something to help me. We gotta be able to get out of here. Uh, Melon, what did you say? I'm having trouble hearing you. Sonny, 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 I can't hear you, bro. <laughs> Guys, this is gonna be so good. Check this out. I'm gonna take the magic touch key and I'm gonna change the barriers into lava. Time to watch him cook. Well, at least I have my diamonds. I'll just wait for this barrier to eventually go away. What the heck? What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> it worked! It actually 
actually work? What the heck? I lost everything. What? I lost everything. And the house is gonna burn. It's surrounded by lava completely. What the heck? Oh, guys, you know it'd be really good? If all this gravel was cake. <laughs> guys, this is really bad. Sonny, you gotta help me. Oh, Melon, what's going on? Wait, why is our house covered in lava? A anyway, sorry, actually, Melon. I got more important things. Ah, this cake. Oh, this cake's good. Guys, I have one last resort. If I go over here, I have a secret base that even Sonny doesn't know about. Now, I'll put on my full net the right. With this, I should have enough resistance to escape. Oh, this cake sure is tasty. Oh, feels good. Okay, guys, I can do this thing. I can do this thing. Let's go. I'm actually doing it. I'm actually doing it. I'm getting out of here. Sonny, check me out. Check me out, bro. I'm gonna make it out. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm gonna lie. I'm actually gonna die. No. Wait, Melon, you thought you could swim through lava? Had full netherite, and I lost it all. Yeah, dude, you should have just got a fire resist potion. We don't don't have any of those, Sonny. It's okay. It's okay. Let me just ask the shopkeeper if they can help. Uh, yeah. Hey, Alex, do you mind getting my friend Melon out of that lava sphere? Please help me. I'm dying on loop. Not a problem. As long as he's willing to do a little bit of housework for me. Hey, Melon. Hey, Melon. What's up, Sonny? What's up? Alex said she can get you out of there if you don't mind doing a little bit of house chores for her. Yeah, whatever. Just get me out of here. Uh, yeah. So, Alex, he says he doesn't mind. He'll do all the house chores you need. Well, you can give him this fire resistance potion, I guess. That's perfect. Thank you. Hey, Melon, I got a fire resistance potion. I just got to throw it on you. Okay, help me. Now, let me just use this magic touch to clear a quick path. Nice. It looked like it actually worked. Now, I've just got to get in here. Uh, Melon? Melon? Help me. Actually, on second thought, I'm going to use this magic key to just get rid of all this lava. Yeah, that's a lot better. Melon! Melon, I got the fire resist! Where are you? Sonny, help me! I'm so scared! I'm so scared! Oh, oh, that, oh, that was terrifying. Oh, thank goodness Alex saved me. Yeah, also, I don't really know what you're freaking out about. I don't even see any lava. Bro, you- There was lava everywhere! You know there was lava everywhere! I mean, there's a little bit behind the house. How did that kill you ten times? No, it was completely surrounding the house, bro. It was like the barrier because came lava out of nowhere. Well, anyways, Melon, you've got to go do some chores for Alex. <sighs> Where's her house? I think it's just over the hill there. All right. Uh, she probably doesn't live in that big of a home, so it shouldn't be too big of a deal. Are you kidding me? She lives in a mega mansion and a mega mansion that's completely overgrown. This is going to take forever. Oh, hey, Melon, do you need a hand with this? This place looks gross. There's weeds and vines and moss everywhere. Yeah, bro, but just be careful. Alex said I'm responsible for anything that happens to her house. Anything? Yep, anything. That includes good things too. So like if good things happen to the house, she'll be really happy with me and, and give me a great bonus. But if bad things happen, oh, well, I'm screwed. Well, in that case, I'll help you out because that's what friends are for. Let me just help you with the grass. Trim these up. Thank you, Sonny. Guys, I'm not actually going to help him with the grass. I just wanted him to be distracted. Now I will use my magic touch key to make it more... More overgrown than ever. And boop. What the heck's happened? What is going on? Our whole house flooded. Uh, guys, my magic touch key went a little off there. I didn't mean to do this. <laughs> But it's pretty funny. I completely killed her dirt. She's gonna freak out. Melon, I don't think Alex is gonna be very happy with your house chores. Oh, she's gonna kill me if she finds out. Her grass is completely messed up. I hope the inside didn't get damaged at all. It looks like it's pretty flood proof. Yeah, bro, let's check it out. How's it looking on the inside? What are you doing? You're breaking her wall, Sonny. Yeah, well, how else are we supposed to get inside? Oh, Ma, you better place those blocks back after. Uh, Melon, I got bad news for you. <laughs> Bro, she's gonna kill me! How could this get any worse? Huh, I wonder, guys. Maybe I can use this magic touch key to spawn in creepers. Let's try this. What the heck? Uh, guys, I think I might have overdone it a little bit. Melon is so finished. Oh, she's gonna kill me. What the heck happened? Are you kidding me? The whole house is destroyed. Oh, Sonny, you gotta help me clean this up, bro. You gotta help. Help. I'm trying. I'm trying. I don't know why there's so many creepers here. It's like you're cursed or something. Oh, no. Sonny. Wait, Sonny, what are you holding? Oh, this? Uh, it's a diamond axe. No, that wasn't a diamond. What was that? 
What was that? It's called the key of magic touch. Are you kidding me? Sonny, it's been you this whole time. <laughs> yeah, bro. I found it in Dr. Longbottom's lab. It wasn't a magic crafting bench. It was this key. I'll kill you, Sonny. No, Melon, wait. I'll grant you one wish if you just chill. Dang it, Melon. I died and lost everything. Not everything, Sonny. Yes, I have the magic touch. I can use this to repay my debt to Alex. Here you go. I'm sorry about your house. With this, you can do anything. Your imagination becomes reality. Wait, Melon, don't give her the key. What do you mean? It's too late, Sonny. You idiot. You could have been the most powerful, richest player in Minecraft with that. How, Sonny? Wait. Oh, yeah. I could have spawned in anything. Like diamonds and repaid my debt. I'm so stupid. But can I get a refund? Can we, can we get a redo? I knew you guys could do it. You successfully restored the magic touch key. Good job. Quandale. So you went on vacation knowing that we would save Minecraft on your behalf and then do something really stupid and bring the key directly to you? Yep. Can always count on you idiots. And I can also count on the viewers to press the like and subscribe buttons right now. And click the next video on screen.